It's your boy, Big Kelv, repping that seven day genetics. And y'all know how I do it. I work out seven days, seven days. Now back to my segment that I call fuck out of here in which I talk about things that bug me. It's uh, typically gym related, but occasionally I do go off that cuff and I talk about things that have absolutely nothing to do with the gym. Um, today is really not a gym thing. It's more of a life thing. And I just have one question. The question is, what if tomorrow never comes? And then you're saying to yourself, what are you saying? It's the end of the world? No, 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 no. But it could be for you. I don't think this spinning ball is going anywhere anytime soon, but you're going to go a lot sooner than it will. So my point I'm making here is, when you put things off for tomorrow and tomorrow never comes for you, you don't accomplish the things you want to. You don't leave behind the things you need to. Let's say you have children and you have this plan in your head to start your own business, but you never push for that thing and you keep putting it off and eventually you never do it. Now, what have you left for your children? You're gone and they have nothing. You need to start doing any plan, any thoughts that you have in your head, start working on it today. If you force yourself work on, to work on it today, you'll be working on it again tomorrow and the next day and the next day. But if you keep putting it off, eventually your days are going to run out and you're never going to have achieved what you want to. Or you're going to get to a point that you're going to age out to do some of the things that you want to do. And then you're going to live in regret like, well, I wish I would have or would if or this, that and the third. Don't live like that. Don't. And we've all done it. We've all thought we wanted to do a thing. And after years of waiting around, we just give up on it. Stop giving up on your dreams because you're doing, well, I'll wait tomorrow. I'll wait till tomorrow. I'll wait till tomorrow. Stop waiting till tomorrow. Today is the time because you're not guaranteed tomorrow. Tomorrow may never come. You wake up dead. I know a lot of people like, wake up dead. Yeah, but you need to figure out what's most important to you right now and make that happen now. Not in a week, not in a month, not in a year. I'm not saying that it's going to bear fruit right away, but you can start working on it right away. You don't have to keep waiting around or waiting for someone else's approval to do what you want to do. Even if it requires money that you have to save up, start laying down the foundation to accomplish what you want. Stop letting it be a dream and make it your reality. I'm telling you, your days are gonna run out. And, and if you don't accomplish it, who is it going to affect? Now, if it's just you and it doesn't really affect you, hey, well, but your family hears you all the time. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, then you die. And that's the last thing I say about you. Well, he, he wanted to do this so badly. Yeah, he was, he was going to do that, but he never got to, around to it. That's because you kept putting it off till tomorrow. And the reason I bring this up is, I have a number of friends, but one friend in particular, he always tells me he's going to, he's going to. And I'm like, well, why can't you start today? Well, man, you know, I gotta do A, B, C, and D before I can do that. I'm like, yeah, but when are you going to do A so you can get that started? He's like, man, it just take time. And you know, at that moment, I want to slap the shit out of him and say, fuck out of here, man. You ain't living, man. All you're doing is making excuses to why you're not accomplishing what you want to. And making excuses does nothing but get in the way of progress. Get your shit done. Stop sitting back. Stop waiting. Lay down a foundation. Make your dreams happen. You know why? Because nobody else is going to do it for you. The next man is not going to try to make a fortune for you. He's going to do it for himself. So you have to do it for yourself. That's enough of this tangent today. I get a little worked up off this because people just keep waiting around. But anyways, it's your boy, Big Kelv. 
you like what you've heard, go ahead and hit that subscribe button below. If you don't like to subscribe, that's cool too. Just watch my damn videos, but make sure you're signed in when you do. Also, if you have an idea for an upcoming video, go ahead and post in those comments below. And if I agree with it, and I'm reading it like, yeah, yeah, then I'll make a video about it. If I don't and it doesn't bother me, it could be valid, but if it doesn't really bother me, I'm just not gonna do a damn video about it. That's just how life works. And if you get offended, I don't, I don't know what to tell you. But anyways, it's your boy, Big Kelv. And as usual, I'll see y'all tomorrow. Peace.